at the very best, we will have to talk about critical decision making at the club. And there's no way you can single out the management if you are talking about decision making and how that decision or the decisions they take impact on the club. It, it's, it's key to, to everything. I keep saying that leadership is everything. If the leadership is good, it reflects on the performance of the team. If it is not good, I mean, same way, you see it on the performance of the team. I, I think that a series of decisions that, uh, I mean, were taken clearly did not help us. I mean, we, we have to be honest and admit that getting CK out at the time we did was not the best. And against the fact that some of the players were going to leave and we didn't have any way or any means to stop them from leaving because they felt that they've, they've done their part for the club. Uh, relatively good offers had come. And if you cannot pay them as those who were uh, offering those deals to them were ready to pay, then you have to let them go. So I agree, some decision taken at the top level didn't help us. And we have to admit and see how going forward. I mean, we don't have the opportunity of playing in the next Champions League because even, even here as, as we speak, we don't know exactly when the Ghanaian League is starting. Even if it starts next month, we would, it would take us some months to finish and determine who goes to Africa. And I, 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 I don't even want to think of that at the moment. But I'm saying that I agree with the opinion that a lot of decisions we took going into this competition uh, were not right. And we need to look at I mean, the, the amount of thinking that goes into the decision we take and see whether in the long distance, I mean, looking into the future, if it is something that will, will, will help the club or something that will really derail the efforts we want to make.